Hello everyone, hope you're doing good, you family and friends, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll be continuing on my first Tamago project uh, that, we've, that we've done two, around three days ago. And yeah, if you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and share with your friends. If you have any questions or problems about this video, please leave them in the comments down below. So, the first thing in today's, um, what we'll be doing is editing the code, improving the code, um, changing the loadout on the app, in, like adding images, adding backgrounds, improving the game. So, let's start. The first thing you want to do is click on File, Open Recent File, My First Tamago Project. After, what you want to do from here is go edit script on the pumpkin, in this case it's click me. By right clicking on the pumpkin and pressing edit script. And then this window will appear. What you want to do from here is, I'm just going to be improving uh, here. As you can see, uh, I'm going to be improving this part. So, um, the first thing what you want to do is... Um, leave it go on line 9 again by pressing enter key on the keyboard and we're gonna say if um, field and if you don't understand any of this uh, code I'll be explaining what it, what it means how it's supposed to work and I'll test it at the end if you just scroll Then um, subtract is what he says it and say this step. Okay, I will now explain what this code means. So what this line means is if field score, which is this, is zero is um, higher than zero, for example one, two, three, etc., then is then it's going to subtract 1 from field score. So it's going to take 1 away from this, 100 or what the number is. And save this stack is basically saved. Okay, after after you wrote this, what you want to do now is um, go on line 12, press enter key, and then you'll be continuing line 30. You want to say else, space, bar and keyboard, and were congratulations. There. You want to answer, answer congratulations. Um, and if. Now I'm going to explain what this code means from line 13 to line 15. So after is saved this stack, um, is going to answer congratulations. Um, then. And then what end if means is since we did if, yeah, since we did um, if right here, after um, you do coding and then you do if field score is something like 100 or bigger than 100, around like that if you use the word if that means at the end you have to use end if because if you don't do end if let's just say we did that for press and apply there's going to be an error saying mi it's missing end if very important you need to do that there so let's press and apply and it should be green now let's just test it Go in the play mode to the tab, and as you can see, it's doing the same thing. Now, the reason um, I added more code than it usually was, like subtract one from field score, you may say, Why do you need that? It's, it's just the same thing. Well, the reason for that is since um, after, let's say, this turns to zero, 
then just keep clicking it, by saving it to zero. There, see, it's um after, no, it's eight. This is one now, I click on it, I click on it again, it says congratulations. Um, I did that say here, and so congratulations. And if it's, so if it's zero, or one, any number, uh, if it's zero, that means it's going to say congratulations. But if beginning of the video, um, we did not have any of this code, so I'm just gonna copy all of this, and I'll tell you what will happen if I already had the, uh, what I had in the beginning. There. So I only had this in the beginning of the video. Let's press apply. It's green. No errors occurred. So you want to click on this. See, no, start. See. It's going minuses, and you can't really beat the game because it's keep gonna keep going minus one hundred, minus five hundred, minus one thousand, etc. It's gonna keep going, and that will be boring because you won't earn anything. You won't see anything it will appear, and it's just a spam tap game, and it would be fun for you to play. That's why um I added um the code. If you want, you can um, add the, as we increase the the part 3, part 4, part 5 of the, the game that's going to be coming up soon. Um, I'm going to be adding, like, say, if it's 50, say, for example, nearly there, I know you really want to know inside the egg, and stuff like that. So, let's just put the code back where it is. There. What you want to do now, after you finish that, you want to, as you can see, this will be a problem when you're playing a game, and it's all grey, and that will just be boring because there's only barely any colour in the game, so how to change this, we're going to add images, add the background. So you want to go and file, um, import as control, image file. Wait a while while it loads and you wanna sorry you wanna um, where image that you want for your background in this case I saved it here so I click on this and here here are the images that I've uh, saved so I'm just gonna pick uh this one but you can choose any images if you want images from there the link will be in the description down below or you can pick any image from any web browser like a uh, search engine like google or yeah so as you can see now the image has um, been imported to your game but you can't see the pumpkin you can't see the button or label to only fix this problem you want to right click on the image, property inspector, wait a while, and here. We're gonna go in basic properties, go in size and position, and press this little icon right here. And then it will automatically do it. Another thing about life code, um, when you have an image and then you change the shape or size, uh, and the location you have to press on lock size and position what this will allow you to do is when next time you launch live code and launch my first tamago project the image won't be reset it to wherever it was before so after you finish this um you're done and yeah if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and uh, subscribe and share with your friends and families and if you have any questions or problems, again, um, don't forget to do it, write them down in the comments below. And every image that I've shown you will be in the description down below. Anyways, bye and have a great day. Have a great day with your day. Bye.